This year, Hurricanes Harvey, Irma, and Maria left many areas ravaged, causing billions of dollars in damage and leaving people without power or even a place to live. For more on how these areas are recovering is Caribbean observer Sadie Fenn. Hi, guys. These storms devastated some Caribbean nations. Repairs continue and supplies are being distributed. But the big question remains, will all-inclusive resorts ever recover? That is emphatically not the big question. It's the big question for Canadians looking for a romantic getaway or a break from the cold weather. What about the people who live in these countries? 30% of Puerto Rico still doesn't have electricity. Mm. That may be. But the good news is that much of the debris has been cleared between the region's airports and resorts, so tourists can get a week of R&R without having to see the conditions their servers are enduring. Are you a monster? <laughs> Why are you so obsessed with resorts? Because if Caribbean all-inclusive resorts don't recover soon, Canadians will be in danger of missing out on a last-minute deal on their Christmas vacation. <laughs> Who cares? Canadians can barf in the pool in lots of places. I do it at Great Wolf Lodge. The Virgin Islands, Barbuda, St. Martins, these places, they still need supplies, aid, and drinking water. What can Canadians do? The most selfless, heroic gesture you can make is haggling with a local for a seashell necklace. <laughs> for the economy. This is shameful. I can't believe you would suggest this. So you're canceling your trip to Anguilla? I well, I didn't actually get cancellation me, insurance, so I, I have it. to go. That's for sure. It's not in my control. Guys, don't worry. The parts of Anguilla you can see from the resorts are beautiful. All right. Sadie, thanks for your time. The Beaverton. All new episode Wednesday on Comedy.